Sam and her children Miller and Layla have been experimenting with trying HelloFresh as a way to simplify their lives while still getting great nutrition. Today, they're going to run you through a recipe to show you just how easy and fun it can be. We're a very busy family and it's so nice coming home at the end of the day with the packages ready and waiting, the food's all there, there's no quick dashes to the supermarket or having to think about anything else. Chicken tikka and garlic rice, Ooh. chicken schnitzels and sweet potato wedges, teriyaki beef and broccoli stir fry, or Caribbean chicken and coconut rice. Well, the what Caribbean chicken one sounds good. Okay, let's get started. Drain the pineapple juice, you'll need two tablespoons later. De-seed and finely chop the long chilli. You can keep the seeds in if you want a little extra heat. Finely chop the tomato and the cucumber. Pick a few mint leaves and thinly slice them. Now combine the chicken thigh, mild Caribbean jerk spice seasoning, salt for the chicken, and a drizzle of olive oil. Toss to coat and set aside. In a medium saucepan, add the coconut milk, water and salt and bring it to the boil. People often report that their children are really keen to get involved and help in the process. I don't really cook with mum that much, but ever since like I've seen HelloFresh, it's really fun. Add the basmati rice, stir, cover with a lid and reduce the heat to low. Cook for 10 minutes. I like how they put little pictures on the instructions so we can see what it should look like. While the rice is cooking, heat a large fry pan over a high heat. Add the pineapple slices and cook until lightly charred, two to three minutes each side. Roughly chop, then transfer into a medium bowl. Add the long red chilli, tomato, cucumber, mint, pineapple juice, and two teaspoons of olive oil. You can season to taste with salt and pepper. Then mix and set aside. Return the same frying pan to a medium heat with a drizzle of olive oil. Add the chicken and cook, turning occasionally until golden and cooked through, probably around 10 to 14 minutes. Now season the rice with a pinch of pepper and stir through the baby spinach leaves until wilted. Slice the chicken, divide the spinach rice and Caribbean chicken between plates. Serve with the cucumber pineapple salsa. Delicious. Let's eat. Yes. Can't wait. I'm starving. Ooh, the pineapple tastes so good. We haven't really cooked that way before, have we? With no. With pineapple. Layla, you're not normally a big meat eater, but what do you think about the flavour of this chicken? Yeah, you're right. I don't usually eat that much chicken, but it is really nice this time. The novelty of the fresh food turning up on the doorstep, the excitement of opening the box to see what selections you can choose from, and then the fun of prepping together as a family. It really takes the mundane out of cooking. For the recipe and more information, head to destinationhappiness.com.